Absolutely love Maka and Endo said, Aunt Tim, so glad we dodged the bullet. Endo's been a revelation. What a player said, Rich. Uh, see what I mean, Craig? People just underestimated Endo. Please help me put some respect on his name. Love the show and thank you for all your hard work. Uh, mate, I absolutely love Waturo. Love him. Didn't know what we were getting when we got him. Did love... I think you can often get a good reading of these situations by how the fans from the departing club reacted and every single one of them sang his praises and understood that, yep, there was a huge loss for them losing their captain, but that it was his dream to come and play in the Premier League. And you know what, mate? He's playing like it was his dream. And that just makes it even more beautiful to be part of, to watch, to enjoy. Um, I don't know how long he has left at the club. Honestly, I don't, but because he's 31, I mean, not because he's not good enough, but I'm going to enjoy every minute of it because he's the type of player that we should all be getting behind because he's living the dream. When Chelsea ended up signing both Lavia and Casado, Bellingham went to Real Madrid. A lot of us, including myself, were laughing at Liverpool. They signed a 30-year-old in Matura Endo, who I knew was a good player, and I thought, that's a good Milner replacement. But that, that's a significant downgrade on what Liverpool are wanting, surely. Well, absolutely not. Endo has come in and been better than Lavia, been better than Casado this season. He has been fantastic for Liverpool and in today's video we're going to break down why Endo could be key for Liverpool in this title race and Liverpool's title chances, the role that he does and actually why he's becoming a crucial player that's basically completely outperformed expectation. You can see Endo here is orange, Fabinho here is blue. This is Endo so far this season compared to Fabinho's stats last season for Liverpool. Fabinho beats Endo in forward pass completion percentage, which basically means that even though Endo completes more forward passes and progressive passes than Fabinho, his are more accurate, but Fabinho plays safer passes. And the only other stat Fabinho beats Endo in is a percentage of Jules one as well. And that's just because Fabinho is...